Welcome to Rethink Your Perspectives blog, dedicated to finding, sharing and discussing a variety of topics around the struggles our clients and audience go through. Each episode, we will discuss a key concept that many humans struggle with and give a variety of perspectives for you to see the concept through so that you can find one that makes it feel easier to deal with. We hope that you get some benefit from these blog posts and we would love to hear your thoughts. Don't hesitate to like, share and comment at the links. Let's dive straight in and look at today's topic. Humans. All different, but all the same? Humans are a remarkable species, encompassing an incredible range of physical appearances, personalities and cultural backgrounds. From the colour of our skin to the shape of our noses, we are all unique in our own way. Yet, beneath these surface level distinctions, we are fundamentally the same. In this blog post, we will explore the concept of human diversity and delve into why it seems challenging for us to fully accept and appreciate our differences. By examining the parallels with other species and inanimate objects, we can shed light on the importance of embracing diversity and treating every person with equality, celebrating our individual strengths and skills rather than degrading each other due to a physical characteristic. The beauty of diversity. Humans, like other species, exhibit an astonishing range of physical characteristics. Just as different breeds of cats or dogs coexist harmoniously, we too should celebrate the diversity within our own species. Imagine a world where every person looked identical, spoke the same language and shared the same beliefs. It would be a monotonous existence, devoid of the richness that comes from encountering different perspectives and experiences. The beauty of our differences lies in the unique perspectives and insights they bring to the table. Each person's distinct physical appearance, cultural background and personal experiences shape their worldview and contribute to the tapestry of humanity. Just as a vibrant painting is composed of various colours and brushstrokes, our collective human experience is enriched by the diverse range of people who inhabit this planet. Consider the analogy of different breeds of dogs. From the majestic Siberian Husky to the playful Spaniels, each breed possesses its own set of characteristics and traits. Yet, despite their differences, they coexist harmoniously within the same species. They do not discriminate against one another based on their physical dissimilarities. Instead, they seemingly do not see the differences and most times are simply happy to meet another dog. Similarly, humans should view our differences as a source of beauty and strength. Our diverse physical appearances, such as varying skin tones, eye colours and body shapes, reflect the incredible adaptability of our species. These differences have evolved over thousands of years, allowing us to thrive in different environments and climates. They are a testament to the resilience and ingenuity of Homo sapiens. Beyond physical attributes, our cultural backgrounds and personal experiences shape our identities. The languages we speak, the traditions we follow and the culture, the values we hold dear are all influenced by our unique upbringings in the different climates and cultures around the world. When we encounter people from different cultural backgrounds, we have the opportunity to learn and grow, expanding our horizons and challenging our preconceived notions. Imagine a world where everyone shared the same beliefs and perspectives. While it may seem comforting at first, it would ultimately lead to stagnation and a lack of progress. It is through encountering different viewpoints and engaging in respectful dialogue that we can foster innovation, creativity and social change. Our differences spark curiosity, inspire new ideas and push us to question the status quo. This gives us the opportunity to continually evolve and upgrade our world. By celebrating our differences, we create a society that values inclusivity and equality. It's a, social, it's a society where individuals are not judged or discriminated against based on their physical appearance, cultural background or personal beliefs. Instead, we recognise that our diversity is a source of strength, enabling us to tackle complex challenges and create a more harmonious world. The Unity of Species While humans may possess unique attributes, we're all part of the same species, Homo sapien. This unity is a remarkable aspect of our existence, akin to the way different buildings, despite their varying designs and purposes, are all referred to as buildings. Just as animals of different breeds coexist peacefully, humans should recognise our commonalities and strive to build bridges rather than walls. Consider the analogy of buildings. This idea came to me whilst out walking with my eight-year-old last weekend, so welcome to an insight in how my mind works. In a cityscape, we encounter a diverse array of architectural styles, ranging from towering skyscrapers to quaint cottages. Each building serves a different purpose, whether it be residential, commercial or cultural. Despite their distinct appearances and functions, they are all referred to as buildings. This is because they share a fundamental characteristic. 
They provide shelter and space for human activities. Similarly, as humans, we share a common biological heritage. Our genetic makeup, regardless of our physical appearances, links us together as members of the Homo sapien species. We all have bones, skin, muscles, organs, hair, walk on two legs, can think and reason, and much more, and are all descended from the same early ancestors. This shared ancestry and commonality of physical features are unifying forces that transcend our individual differences. It reminds us that beneath the surface level variations, we are all interconnected and part of a larger human family. Animals of different breeds also provide an insightful parallel. Cats, for example, come in various breeds, each with its own physical characteristics and temperaments. Yet, despite these differences, cats of different breeds do not discriminate against one another. They coexist peacefully, focusing on their shared needs and instincts. They form social bonds, play together and communicate through a universal language of body signals and vocalisations. In the animal kingdom, the focus is on survival, cooperation and meeting shared needs. Animals do not judge or discriminate against one another based on physical dissimilarities. They recognise that their collective strength lies in unity and collaboration. Humans, too, should adopt this mindset and recognise that our shared humanity is a source of strength and resilience. By recognising our commonalities, we can build bridges that connect us rather than walls that divide us. It is through understanding, empathy and compassion that we can foster a sense of unity and create a more inclusive society. When we focus on our shared needs, aspirations and emotions, we can transcend the superficial differences that often lead to discrimination and prejudice. Building bridges requires active effort and a willingness to engage with others who may have different perspectives and experiences. It involves listening, learning and seeking common ground. By embracing our shared humanity, we can break down barriers and foster a sense of belonging for all people, regardless of their backgrounds or physical attributes. The Origins of Discrimination The tendency to segregate, label and discriminate against others is indeed a complex issue deeply ingrained in human history. Throughout the ages, societies have developed hierarchies and divisions based on various factors such as race, gender and social class. These divisions have often been used as tools of power and control, perpetuating a cycle of inequality and marginalisation. The roots of discrimination can be traced back to the innate human desire to categorise and make sense of the world around us. Our brains naturally seek patterns and classifications as a way to understand and navigate our environment. However, when this natural inclination, inclination to categorise is coupled with social structures and power dynamics, it can lead to harmful consequences. Historically, societies have used these divisions as a means to establish dominance and maintain control over certain groups. By creating hierarchies based on race, for example, some groups have sought to justify the subjugation and exploitation of others. Similarly, gender-based discrimination has been perpetuated to maintain patri patriarchal systems that limit opportunities and rights for women. It's crucial to acknowledge that these divisions are man-made constructs created by humans to serve specific interests and maintain power imbalances. They do not reflect the inherent worth and equality of every person. Every person, regardless of their race, gender or social class, possesses inherent dignity and deserves to be treated with respect and fairness. Recognising the artificial nature of these divisions is the first step towards dismantling discrimination. It requires a collective effort to challenge and question the societal norms and structures that perpetuate inequality. By acknowledging that these divisions are not inherent or natural, we can begin to break free from the constraints they impose on us. Education plays a vital role in this process. By promoting awareness, empathy and critical thinking, we can challenge the biases and stereotypes that underpin discrimination. Education helps us to understand the historical context of these divisions and encourages us to question the status quo. It empowers people to challenge discriminatory practices and advocate for equal rights and opportunities for all. Furthermore, fostering inclusive communities and spaces is essential. By creating environments that celebrate diversity and promote inclusivity, we can break down barriers and foster understanding between different groups. This involves actively seeking out diverse perspectives, engaging in dialogue and promoting empathy and respect. It's important to remember that diversity is not a threat but a strength. We em when we embrace and celebrate our differences, we create a society that is more resilient, innovative and compassionate. By valuing the unique contributions that each person brings, we can build a more equitable and harmonious world.
the power of acceptance. Accepting and embracing our differences is a transformative mindset that goes beyond erasing individuality or disregarding the challenges faced by marginalised groups. It's about recognising that diversity is not a threat, but a source of strength that enriches our collective experience and fosters a more inclusive society. By celebrating our differences, we can create an environment where everyone feels valued, respected and empowered to be their authentic selves. It is important to emphasise that accepting diversity does not mean ignoring or downplaying the struggles faced by marginalised groups. In fact, it's quite the opposite. Embracing diversity requires acknowledging and addressing the systemic barriers and inequalities that certain individuals or communities face. It involves actively working towards dismantling these barriers and creating equal opportunities for all. By celebrating our differences, we create a society that values and appreciates the unique contributions of each individual that each individual brings. It's through this celebration that we can tap into the vast array of perspectives, talents and experiences that exist within our diverse human family. This, in turn, leads to innovation, creativity and social progress. Acceptance begins with each individual human. It requires introspection and a willingness to change our own biases and preconceived notions. We must actively seek to understand and appreciate the perspectives of others, even if they differ from our own. This involves engaging in open and respectful dialogue, listening with empathy and being open to learning from diverse experiences. It's important to recognise that accepting and embracing differences does not mean we have to agree on everything. It's about fostering an environment where diverse opinions can coexist and be respectfully discussed. Through these conversations, we can gain a deeper understanding of one another and find common ground, even amidst our differences. Creating a society that values and respects diversity requires collective action. It involves advocating for inclusive policies and practices in our schools, workplaces and communities. It means actively challenging discriminatory practices and standing up against injustice. By working together, we can create a ripple effect that extends beyond our immediate circles, fostering a more inclusive and equitable society for all. Overcoming prejudice. To truly overcome prejudice, it is crucial for us to come together as a collective. Education serves as a powerful tool in breaking down stereotypes and cultivating empathy. By incorporating diverse perspectives and experiences into our educational systems, we can create an environment that encourages understanding and acceptance. In our schools, workplaces and communities, it is important to actively promote diversity. This means embracing people from all walks of life, regardless of their race, ethnicity, gender, sexual orientation or any other characteristic that makes them unique. By doing so, we create spaces where individuals feel safe and empowered to express their true selves without fear or judgment of discrimination. There is no other person on the planet that is any better or worse than any other. We are all perfectly unique good at some things, bad at others, and no two of us look exactly the same. Challenging discriminatory practices is another vital step in overcoming prejudice. We must be vigilant in identifying and addressing any unfair treatment or biases or stereotypes that exist within our society. By speaking out against discrimination and advocating for equal rights and opportunities, we can work towards creating a more inclusive and just society for all. Ultimately, our goal should be to build a society that values and uplifts every individual, irrespective of their differences or any stereotypes about their colour or culture. By celebrating diversity and embracing the richness it brings, we can foster a sense of unity and create a world where everyone feels respected, valued and included. Together, through our collective efforts, we can make a positive impact and pave the way for a brighter and more harmonious future. What do you think? In a world that thrives on diversity, it's a, it is disheartening to witness the persistent divisions and discrimination that plague our society. However, by recognising our shared humanity and celebrating our differences, we can pave the way for a more inclusive and harmonious future. Let us embrace the beauty of diversity, just as other species coexist peacefully and buildings of various designs stand side by side. By treating every person with equality and respect, we can create a world where our differences are celebrated and unity prevails. Stay tuned for our next episode, where we will be starting a short sequence that covers the universal laws of our universe. Make sure you're subscribed to my LinkedIn newsletter or my website to know when it's published. Our next live event, Ignite the Phoenix, will be starting on the 3rd of March 2024. During the event, we will be addressing the fact that you know you can do better and you want to do better, 
but there is something standing in your way. You feel like you have little or no control over the direction your life is going in. Ignite the Phoenix shows you how to break free from the limitations, unleash your full potential and take control of your life so you can feel more fulfilled and enthusiastic every day. If this article resonates with you and you want to discuss it further, then get in touch today, either here or through any of my social medias or schedule a call to discuss it with me directly. I look forward to speaking with you soon. To your success, Jay. Rethink your perspective.